How old were you when 14. you first started wearing makeup? We used to get on the bus in the morning and put our makeup on because my mom wouldn't let us wear makeup. And I put on like way too much makeup <laughs> like, and your mouth would be glued together practically. <laughs> yes. Do you feel like you've learned anything about beauty from your daughters? How much pressure there is on them to be unauthentic in a way. Again, I think it comes back to being comfortable with yourself. Yeah. Like they don't need to paint somebody else's face on. They're good. So you're known as the skin person in the industry because so many of the celebrities who you work with look completely ageless. How do you tell them to take care of what's underneath the makeup? You have to use SPF, you have to use moisturizer, you have to exfoliate so it can go in your skin. It's just a good habit, like, you know, you brush your teeth, you put on your sun protection, you put on your moisturizer, and it's just, it just has to be part of what you do every morning. And I often, I give people products too, I'm like, here, this is what you should use. How have you managed to maintain those client relationships through the years? Being real, like I'm a very real person and I tell the truth. For me, the sisterhood is really important. I've had relationships with people for 15 years. I keep doing work because I love what I do. Our job is to put some self-confidence and put some good in there, mm -hmm. besides just lipstick. <laughs> and a little lipstick. And a little lipstick.